Right then, this is Sharky from Sharkade. Now today, I'm gonna to show off one of my most favorite builds to date. This is a Mortal Kombat custom stand-up 32-inch arcade system. Now then, the design on this, I absolutely love. If you're familiar with my channel, you would have seen the Big Trouble in Little China custom arcade. Now then, this is sort of the same style themed unit. Um, the gold on this just stands right out. It's so beautiful. I will leave some um, photos on our Reddit page. Um, so I'll leave a link in the description. You can go to the Reddit page and fully check out this artwork, man. It is absolutely stunning from top to bottom. Now this is one of our 24 terabyte hyperspin builds. It comes with a Ryzen 5 CPU, 16 gig of RAM, 120 gig SSD, an RTX 3060 graphics card, a 16 terabyte hyperspin base system, and the 24 terabyte hyperspin add-on. Now you've got over 100,000 games on the system, and as you can see, you've got games like Mortal Kombat 11 and a ton of next-gen titles. So then, like I say, I've got to start off with this artwork, man. This is absolutely stunning. If I'm gonna build an arcade for myself, it's gonna to have to be this style, this design. Now, I've used this gold team molding in the past and it does look like gold. It's absolutely stunning, really vibrant, really clean. Um, these gold ball tops as well, I've been waiting on those arriving. Um, I also have been playing around um, with my printing process and managed to come up with these custom dust covers um gold dust covers now if you look on there it does have the mortal kombat dragon logo on there with a nice chinese symbol going all around the dust cover itself and the actual ink on there looks gold also on there so everything is just a really nice gold look to it um zoom in there and um, in the background of the control panel there we do have goro's lair and then that nice mortal kombat logo there on the front there, we have finish him, this nice Chinese border with those dragons on each side. And I believe when I originally done these dragons for the Big Trouble in Little China unit, I think I vectored those dragons off the original Mortal Kombat design. I think, um, I think so anyways, but them just look absolutely stunning on there with that nice border, that cool looking Mortal Kombat logo there um, just looks absolutely outstanding the colors the gold looking colors on this unit just really stand out um, on the top we've got that artwork coming in and then that nice Mortal Kombat logo now the quality of Goro on the side here is just absolutely outstanding zoom in there and you can see every bit of detail in them. And then that Mortal Kombat logo down on the bottom with this nice gold sort of trim going around the artwork. Move over to the right hand side. And then we have Shao Kahn. And just move up there. Looks absolutely cool, man. Um, throughout the center artwork, we do, do have these, I think it's Shokan, it's pronounced Shokan logos, um, going all the way through the unit. A bit like the big trouble in Little China when I had the Wing Kong logos and that nice red, um, it's got a nice red background, um, gives it that nice Chinese look, that nice gold tea mold in there, all around the amp area. And then we have that gold trim around the screen area. And then that repeating artwork there. Move up to the marquee. And we have that outstanding looking marquee. Just looks really cool. Move around to the back. And we have those Mortal Kombat logo custom grills. Um, I think the camera is picking up that gold look really well. Um, they look like they need a little bit cleaning off there. A little bit of cleaning off, but um, does that have, the, uh, that doesn't have the protective film on, no. 
so yeah they just need a little rub down there but that gold it looks absolutely stunning on there and then move over to the right hand side and that repeating artwork there in the background now this does have a subwoofer on the back of the unit as well and um, we have hdmi out port we also have two usb ports on the back there so um if you wish to purchase a unit like this i'll be putting this up on um sharkhead.co.uk now we do build to order if you're not familiar with my channel my work we do build to order there is a quite long waiting list now of builds um and it's it's just so many orders flying in through the door um so it basically comes on a first come first serve basis get your order in you go on the list and once it's time for your build i'll contact you go through design work um and you can end up with stunning looking units like this um like i say i'm, I'm just completely in awe with this design it's it is my favorite by far um, I don't think there's going to be many that's going to top this. I do have some favourites as well, some other favourites, um, some really nice. Big Trouble in Little China is another one. Um, really love that design. Um, both designs, I've got two styles. I've got like a green style and I've got the red style like this. Um, and there's so, so many others, uh, Street, Street Fighter Retro Wave ones, like that one there on the floor. And um, we do have a Street Fighter Championship Edition unit getting done as well. We've got a lot of that done today because it's a smaller unit. Once I get rid of this, the next big unit's in, in the process. Um, the next one's going to be, I think, a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. I do have to contact the customer about a... Was it... Um, a Rick and Morty one? I think that's coming up very, very soon. Um, so... I've got a few people to contact and yeah, let us know what you think of this design, man. Um, me personally, if it was me buying an arcade, I would go with this um, outright. Like I say, we do do all custom work. Everything on the side art and that is all custom designed. Um, I find the highest possible quality images and then i vector them and um, render them to the highest possible quality and then i merge my layers and stuff like that and come out with works of art so make sure you like share subscribe to the videos hit that notification bell and make sure i'll catch us in the next one and i'll see you later bye